good people, welcome back to Freedom with Frida in case you're new here. Hi, my name is Frida Nguku and this is the best place for you. So subscribe and join the family. Uh, my previous video used to be do reinstallation. <laughs> Removing the wallpaper that was here, which was actually a grey wallpaper. This is my house and you remember the wallpaper was looking like this. So we decided to just leave this part because uh, there's no point of removing it because uh, the TV will just cover it up. There's no point. Um, so today is that installation day. And like I mentioned, I am trying to give you ideas in case you want to save some money. Now, uh, I want to do an imaginable fluted panels onto this wall. I'm going to be putting photos here you can tell so that you can know what it is that I'm talking about. So I want to give you a wallpaper that is made to look like the panels themselves. So this is the wallpaper. It comes in different shades. We have gray, we have brown, we have um, cream, depending on the kind of fluted panels you'd like to have in your house and of course the colors that you're working with. As you know, I'm working with gray in the house, gray and white, so this will definitely work perfectly for me. So I wanted to do um, just one side of um, the panel and then have the other side of it as the other wallpaper which is actually this which is something i actually need to show you guys this is what we call embossed wallpaper it looks like it's bigger than the normal wallpaper but it's just the same size it's 0 0.5 by 10 meters but now it looks bigger because of the texture so when it's put in a roll it definitely this is how thick the wallpaper is and this is how it looks so i am going to be doing the fluted wallpaper on the side and then there's one which gives me like a marble feel which is one of the best wallpapers it's um it has some very thick texture so that's what i'll be doing at the middle so like i was saying i wanted to have one side with the panel and then the whole of this other side with this one then i realized it's going to imbalance my house because on this area i have an office so i have decided that i'm going to do um at the end i'm going to have the fluted panels the imaginary the wallpaper panel and then on that other side also i get the same and then at the middle i'll have now the imposed white wallpaper so that's what we are doing and that's what I want to start so you, I can show you guys. Let's hold our fingers and expect that this is going to turn beautiful. And just in case you are thinking now oh, fluted panels are very expensive. How do I get to get that for my house and still make my space look beautiful? I am giving you ideas. I am giving you ideas. So I've already mixed my glue. Here it is. I think I'm not going to show you mixing glue because guys you've seen me done that like so many times. But this is how the glue is looking. Um, not so runny and not so thick. Good enough. Anyway, let's get started. In case as I install something pops out in your mind and there's, there's some questions you want to ask all those things, just leave it in the comment section. I'll be back and I'll answer you guys. This is scheme to accumulate why my apron is dirty. My apron is meant to prevent that, right? So here we are. <laughs> anyway, let's get started. I'm starting off with the fluted, the imaginable fluted panel. Right, so this is the wallpaper that I'm going to start with. And this is how it looks. Like I keep saying, we sell the best quality wallpaper. I get that question a lot. Why is your wallpaper 1500? Why is your wallpaper 1650? Why is your wallpaper 1800? Because if you want to get the best, you definitely have to pay for value. The thickness of this wallpaper, it does not even tell them if I did this. Try doing that with the 1000 wallpapers that you people are talking about. It's going to tear out. And then when you install this wallpaper, the way I'm going to install it and leave it is the way it's going to be even 10, 8, 10 years from now. But the others with time, it starts to fade off. This color starts to go, especially when you wipe. Um, so the glossy bit of it, the shiny bit of it, um, the value that you get from the one that you're buying cheaper, I'm not going to give you guys less value so that you people can buy. I love me all day. No. So first step, cut the first piece, and that's what I'm doing. I can comfortably drop it down, by the way, and nothing will happen to it. So here we are. So I'm going to take the first piece right here 
Oh, then we don't. Use my cutter and just cut it. This process I've done it so many times. I think you people have become insolent nowadays. Here's our face. Apply glue onto this piece. And apply glue to the wall. Now let's get to the installation part. Our training is still ongoing, guys. In case you want to learn our services and our products, it's ten thousand right now. For two weeks, you learn, you know how to install wallpapers, contact papers, wall mirrors are tough. And also, you become a part-time employee. So that means when you have jobs, we can give you. And that's a skill you can have for the rest of your life. Not that you can have, you're going to have for the rest of your life. So in case you want to make money out of it, or make this your business, there's enough for all of us guys. So get in touch with me, and I will book you in for the training getting the idea that I'm trying to give you guys of the fluted panels. Here we go. in the mirror so foggy but i've never seen clearer i don't really think anyone can save me and honestly i'm not really sure i want saving i like to be my own worst enemy there's no risk if you don't try it anything fingers crossed first piece of the panel is installed i hope it's giving you guys the illustration of what i'm talking about that feeling of uh the panels so now i want to combine it with this just to have the marble feel at the middle of where the TV will be and then have the same piece at the end of the wall. So let's start off with this impost. Very beautiful impost wallpaper. I 
I love that it has some bit of grayish in it. So it will match with the gray part of this one. And also the gray side of my house. Right, let's get moving. Playing got a really bad habit. If it moves, gotta grab it. Fuse like a magnet. Lose won't have it till I'm doomed in a casket. I ain't playing, got a weird mind. If you work eight hours, I'ma work nine. If the shoot tastes sour, you should taste mine. I'ma stay in power for a long time. Get up, nah, I ain't a quitter. Toss me the ball, I'm a really big hitter. Big picture, I'm a straight killer. Rising the song to the highest bidder. Got juice, got gas, I'ma move fast. New shoes, new tracks, like who's that? I'm new, come back better than last. Yeah, it's a new me, never gonna look back. You never gonna look back. Cause damn, I was built to last. You move slow when I move fast. And that's facts. Only I can make a change. Slowly take a step today. I will never be the same. Cause that's what it takes. Piece of the post wallpaper. It's looking so beautiful. I actually really, really love it. 
so now i have this other piece which is going to this other side and we noted that normally wallpapers have three pieces depending on how uh, long your wall is but on a standard wall which is 2.3 or 2.5 meters it will have like one two three pieces i know right now you can't tell but these are three pieces of the rolls so we realized that it might not necessarily be balanced so we added another piece onto the panel wallpaper and now i have a piece here so once i install you're going to see some uh, another piece that is going to remain on this other side and that's exactly what i want to do so i am going to install this on this side then i'll fix because this is what is um lying on the edge i'll fix on this other side i'll explain as i do this so you'll be able to see that so i've already cut my piece and now i just want to apply glue on the wall There's no pattern, I'm just going to pull it off and down. Checking at the other wallpaper, I can tell that this is the side that was on the edge. So I'm putting that side with this other edge here. Just to get that consistency. what you think of this combination you can have any other wallpaper here you can have a plain one you can have a black one you can have a gray one whatever it is that you want i mean you're just giving what i wanted to show you guys is just to give yourself a panel a feel on your wall if you're not able to go and purchase the real panels just so we have wallpapers that will give you that effect and that's exactly what i've done so like i mentioned what i wanted to do is i wanted to have this side with the panel and then the whole of this other side i'll put a photo here so you can um uh, understand what i mean then the whole of this side to have this um embossed white film but then i realized it won't be balanced especially because there's a there's an office here there's a something there's a bookshelf here which i'm thinking whether to still put it back or not but this is the after and I think it balanced well having this side and this side and then at the middle we have this embossed white with a marble look. From your distance I'm sure you can tell it's like a marble look. But this is not a contact paper, this is actually an embossed wallpaper. Let me know what you think in the comment section. Do you like the outcome? Do you feel like I should have just maintained my grey plain wallpaper because I'm a plain person? You never know. Would you do this? Would you put um, a wallpaper, a panel wallpaper, just to give yourself that feel? So this is the after. I'll show you the after uh, when, when I'm not on the screen. And then I'll also show you the after when you put back everything. The TV, this, uh, the office, the office is on this side. Everything put back. Then we can see how the after looks like. 
thank you so much guys for being here thank you for watching to the end if you're interested in any of our services could be training wallpapers contact papers wall mirrors uh, artificial grass whatever it is or you just want to learn this get in touch with me 0712-027-807 and i will help you beautify your space or help you learn a skill that will pay you for the rest of your life stay positive stay focused and see you in my next video bye all right there goes the after with everything put back that is everything that's supposed to be on there i actually do need another tv stand we are not going to talk about that so when I was talking about the this is where the office is, I meant if we just have this panel on this side and then we continue with the marble on the other side, it was going to look so imbalanced, especially because um there's this it's like there's this side and then there's this side because my bookshelf could not fit here. So we decided to have these two sides, and then at the middle we now have the marble, and this marble is looking so good, guys so good even when i zoom in and because it's been installed by pro you can't actually tell what the line is like you 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 feel like i've just put a whole piece there but let me know what you think of this look at the end of it all i love it i love it so 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 much it has brightened my house it's given my house some texture <laughs>